stayed on the campsite last night in the morning and the next day we've gone and brought a baguette fourth baguette of the week fourth baguette of the week love the baguette Oh, Having a beer again. <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna wing it and stay in a? How do you how do you pronounce it again? Al Alberg 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 which is over there tonight. Much to Charlotte's dismay. How happy are you to have a bed? Very good. Very, very nice. Oh, don't. This is our campsite for tonight. There is a storm coming, as you can hear. Day nine, we're, uh, well, I think you just saw where we're camping tonight. It's absolutely incredible. Really, really tough climb up. Really tough. Can you hear how noisy these are, actually? Trying to sleep at night and Charlotte rolling around like that. It's not good. But um but yeah, so we're uh, camping here tonight. Hopefully it's not too windy. There was gonna be a storm rolling in, but I think we're good. Um and we're starting to get into a bit more of a sort of mountaineering, I alpine think. Alpine terrain, yeah, it's proper hard hardcore. But proper hardcore. Really enjoying it, it's good. Good morning. Good morning. Day 10? Yeah. Sort of losing track of days. Just next day, we're uh, walking to a lake that we plan to camp at today. Go swimming. Go swimming. Hopefully. It's been a bit of a rough start to the morning. The campsite we pitched on last night was very lopsided, so I had Charlotte rolling into me all night. No thunder though, no storm, which is good. And then on the way down to, we just had breakfast at the bottom of the hill. Charlotte managed to fall over. Yeah, that was great. Hurt First her ankle. Time. First one to fall over. Wasn't me. It wasn't even hard ground. It was like nothing. Was so, uh, about 15k today, fairly uphill. Taking it slow because we're a bit tired after yesterday's monumental ascent. Hey. Baby. I assume it's down here. Down, down. No, just try. They'll move. I promise Stop you they'll move. Off. You do it then. Come on then. I'll go in front. Come on then. There's one down as well. Can you move, please? What do I think? I think it's amazing. Absolutely incredible. Worth a try. Even better if we can get in it at the upper end. Do I have to just go for it? Yeah. Oh, fuck off, fish. Then turn back around. <laughs> don't push me in all the way. I don't want to get my head in. Do it, don't be a pussy. How good was that? That was great. I didn't, even, that. didn't even get in. No, you're shit. But 
I jumped straight in. I was in. Yeah. Great. Camping here tonight should be really good. This is our campsite. Be completely honest, it's been an absolute shit show. <laughs> we ended. Uh, why not? Yeah. It's been beautiful, really, really lovely, but a bit of a shit show. We've ended up in France. I think we've taken a bit of a shortcut. All of a sudden, everyone started saying uh, bonjour rather than hola, and we went, something's not quite right here. So we're in France, and we're going to try and make our way back onto the trail somehow. We just passed our first venomous snake. Saw a Spanish lad taking pictures under a rock and he said it was a viper. That's a venomous snake, babe. That's like the general. What? Yeah, no, a viper. It's a type of snake, isn't it? There's one of them anyway. We're in a ski resort at the moment. As you can see, there's no snow. But uh, during the snowy season, all the way up here, chair lifts and stuff like that. So. Pretty cool. Yes. <laughs> so good. This what? How happy are you? Very happy. So we've decided Charlotte's hurt her knee. I've hurt my knee. We're struggling a bit. We've done 10 days of dirt, tents and grime. So we're staying. We keep making mistakes, so we give up. <laughs> we do keep making mistakes. Ended up in France. So we're staying at a nice little ski resort hotel. This is our bedroom, feels like luxury. Come around here, into the lovely bathroom. <laughs> what I've done is fill up the bidet with water to keep some beers cold. Absolutely bloody brilliant. Breakfast with a view. It's a bit of a change from the tent. Mm -hmm. It's lovely. This is the hotel we're spending our zero day at. Hotel Kandanchu. Relaxing. Lovely view of the mountains out the front. So, I'm feeling very full. <laughs> Little English piggies. Pizza, salad, portion of chips. And then we asked for an, another portion of chips. She looked at me like I was mental. <laughs> the view's not bad either. So we're staying here tonight at the hotel one more night. And then tomorrow we're heading to St. Julian or something like that, I think it's called. Do you want an ice cream, Charlotte? Silly question. I got this weird little waffle thing had one before, very nice. <laughs> oh my god, don't be such a dick. Good morning. Welcome to our 13th day in the GR11. Ooh. Had a nice rest day as you saw yesterday. Uh, left the hotel this morning at about seven o'clock. And we are on our way to St. St. Paul de Gillian or something. I work out what it's actually called. In. <laughs> San de Galileo. That's where we're going. But um, yeah, we're feeling good. Rested up. 24k today. Over about eight hours. And then okay. hopefully. And then we go back shopping. And then we need to do a bit of food shopping. Have one muddy boot, one clean boot. I just fell in a fucking shitty muddy puddle. <sighs> Cunt. Don't you laugh?
So this morning we've walked all the way up this valley and then switched back all the way up this mountain up to here. Yeah, boy. I think we're just 2,100, which for reference, I think Snowden's about 1,000, so twice like Snowden. 1,080. Let's go. I think, whoa, nearly fell over. What? I think that might be my favorite section so far. Really like postcard picturesque walking down the valley. We are going the wrong way now. We've got to go down here, yeah? Yeah. follow that all the way along. Good job, Charlotte's keeping track of me. Well, I'll update you guys, but no, that was really, really beautiful. So now we're going to arrive at a road and then we've got another sort of like 5k until we reach the next town where we're going to resupply at the supermarket. So just arrived outside where we're heading to so we're heading down there to Salent de Galileo or whatever it's called. Um, going to resupply there, sleep somewhere along here and then the goal in the next two days is to go over this motherfucker. Um, it's a little bit daunting, but I'm really excited. Yeah, it's a piece of piss. Oh my god. Is it good? Are you filming? No. Yeah, it's great. It's a mess, but it's great. We look like absolute hobos. Look at my tan. Stuck on the side of the street, it's beautiful. And then we're just sitting here, making the place look. Oh, I don't know whose idea it was to walk another hour Me. after we've eaten. Yeah, what's my idea? But my chest strap feels like it's about to explode. Oh. oh. So after walking for an extra hour, we ended up camping in a parking lot. This is the last sort of campsite that we could get before. The prettiest parking lot you've ever seen. Yeah, it's very pretty. Beautiful scenery. There's a river just down here. Have a wash in. Um, but yeah, it's better than nothing. First it was a fox. Now it's a big, angry bed hog. Get away from my tent. Um, we just got kicked out the tent by the police. It was the police, wasn't it? I well, think it was the police. No camping allowed in Spain. For be damned. So, which is kind of a lie because that's not the rules. But, so we just, uh, we're up early. Wake up. Having breakfast. We were camping fairly conspicuously over in the car park, but. And it's very cold. Wet, wet, wet. So we came this morning from the bottom of this valley all the way up. Yeah, carry on going. Across here and then up by the dam. Walking across the dam. A little bit 
wobbly, make me feel a little bit sick. But the view is incredible. I'm over there, on top of that, is where we got to go tomorrow morning, so we're just finding somewhere to camp. This is our home for the night, bloody high up, there's snow on the mountains. Tomorrow, which is our highest peak, we're walking, there's people walking there, the scale. Up, up this little rock here. Up, 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 up. And there's Charlotte. somewhere to go to the toilet so it is it's now our I think it's our this is two weeks tonight so this is our uh, 14 day camp spot as you can see it, it is mind-blowing and I, I honestly feel really 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 grateful that we're both able to do this um, it's all just hitting you now how lucky we've been so feeling really good we've got a big long climb tomorrow up there but we're just going to enjoy this for now. Uh, as you can see, there's still snow about, so it's going to be a bit of a cold one. So we're going to get to bed. Catch you all in the morning.